Hello, you guys. So I wanted to do a quick faceless video on um, the Bath and Body Works products I purchased and reviewed in a previous video. Well, I kind of just like showed them. I unboxed them. That's the word for it. And I said I was going to come back and do an update. And I figured out that now is a good time to do it because Bath & Body Works is having their semi-annual sale. Now, some of these products are not available currently, I think because they're seasonal in nature, but a few of them are. So I'm just going to review how the few products that I have been able to find on their site um, that are covered by the sale ended up working out for me. So before I get into that, I just want to say that in doing that Bath and Body Works haul, I already knew that I prefer natural ingredients that just more or less solidified it, even though I did enjoy, um, I have enjoyed the, the products I've used thus far, except one, um, I think I am going to go back to just using natural products for, body um although the bath and body works body washes didn't bother me at all so maybe i'll continue to use those on occasion and the sprays you know i have i like the calypso spray i'll talk about that in a second um actually why don't i get started um and let's start with the pink Cal pink coconut calypso products so during that haul i purchased a pink Cal pink coconut calypso micellar body wash and a pink coconut calypso fine fragrance mist i actually like both of those so let's start with the body wash i love it because it's just this crisp clean pink color the branding and the smell and the feel of the product match the overall branding just very crisp um lightly feminine um or i should say classically feminine i guess um fresh just very fresh and I don't know like a pink uplifting slightly tropical maybe smell um and I enjoy that body wash a lot actually I was actually kind of like a little sad when I um started running low on it I haven't used it all because I switched to the another one um the starry nights which I'll talk about maybe actually yeah um but I, yeah, so I highly recommend the pink Calypso. I felt clean. It didn't leave a sticky film. I felt moisturized after showering with it. Um, and the smell is just like perfect before bed. Um, probably perfect before, um, heading out on like a summer day. I think I switched. I, yeah, by the time it started to get really hot here, I'd probably switch to something else. And I also had some other product, like I had this lavender um, soap, like pure lap French lavender, a natural soap that I was also using. So I don't know that I use the pink Calypso during the day, but definitely before bed, I use that a lot. Um, now during the day, I used the body wash or not the body wash, the the um, body mist. And. I love that as well. Um, it's good for just like a quick, fresh spritz. It doesn't smell like fruit, like a lot of um, a lot of their products are like pear and vanilla and stuff like that. That wasn't going on at all. Um, it's it smells exactly like the um, pink calypso uh, body wash. So that was actually perfect. Um, and I highly recommend it. It was good for just like, I don't know if you feel, if you feel unfresh, um, because it's humid or whatever, just a nice spritz. It's not overpowering. It's light. People don't look at you like, oh my God, you just like spritzed on a bunch of cheap fragrance. You know, it's not like that at all. Um, so yeah, I highly recommend that one too. That's one that I would, I might purchase again. Like I, you know, I wouldn't have to have my arm twisted to purchase that again. Um, so moving on, I feel like I should tell you my favorite product. 
um, which was a hand soap, and they don't have it, but I think it's because it's seasonal, um, and it's not, so it's not available in the semi-annual sale right now, but they will probably offer it for the fall, and, um, that is actually the Warm Autumn Glow hand soap, so that was by far my favorite. I'm just throwing it in here in this order for some reason. I don't know. Because it came to mind and I don't want to forget. So the Warm Autumn Glow Hand Soap. I actually talked about it in that original unboxing video. Um, it just smells, to me, it's one of the more masculine fragrances. But it's just so, I mean, it's like a hint of forest. But not really, kind of, maybe like a, a tad bit of cedar or something. And it reminds me of like a men's cologne that's not too overpowering and but it you know what I think it's the unisex unisex to slightly masculine in fragrance um but it's just such a I don't know like a non-offensive but clean refined fragrance for a hand soap and I liked it because it was a foam and it didn't make a mess unlike my least favorite product which was the um winter apple hand soap and this one I didn't get as a foam maybe I would have enjoyed it more but the fragrance is also kind of too sweet it's this thick red like if you get it in the liquid soap version which isn't available now but probably will be coming back in winter um it's thick it's red it's gloppy it it leaks onto your sink and you have to go back and clean it up so I really just enjoy that didn't enjoy that and the smell wasn't one of my favorites like it wasn't bad but it kind of smelled like, you know, cheap kitty hand soap, kind of. Or I shouldn't say cheap. I don't know. Um, I don't know. But it, it reminded me of, like, all the things I don't like about Bath and Body Works. Um, but someone probably enjoys it. I think it's one of the favorite um, series, I guess, or collections they do, the Winter Apple. Um, so I didn't like the hand soap. But surprisingly, I actually don't mind the Winter Apple Body Lotion. So I would use that. That was just like the first lotion I happened to grab actually and try. And I tried it first because I thought it was going to be my least favorite. So I could just like use it really quickly and then move on to something else. But, you know, I don't mind it. So like after showering at night with my pink Calypso body wash, I applied the winter apple body lotion in the bottle, um, in the upright bottle. And, um, it was pretty good. The, so in the lotion, the scent isn't too powerful. It's not, it's kind of, it's nice. It's kind of fresh, I guess, um, a little, but it's not like, it doesn't smell like cheap and candy like to me. Um, and so like it paired well with the Calypso body wash and I could just like moisturize with it and go to bed and feel clean and fresh and lightly fragranced. And I actually enjoyed that. Would I buy it again? I don't know. Maybe if it goes back to that $3 sale, perhaps. Um, I have some other lotions I've not tried from them that I think I'll enjoy more. Plus, as you know, I prefer my all natural body products as well. Although like I'm not, you know, 100% all natural with my products yet. So um, about the winter apples. So they don't have the body lotion. They don't have the hand soap. What they do currently have is the body cream, which um, that's available on the site, I believe, for like just under seven dollars or something. Um, I've not tried it in the body cream formula, and I don't think I've tried any of my body creams that I purchased from the haul yet. But if you're into that scent, um, I can tell you the 24 hour moisturizer was very moisturizing. I believe the body cream might have more shea butter or something in it um, might be richer. So I would give it a try if I were you. Um, I actually still have some of the lotion here. So I and also it's like a fruit smell. So I don't think I would be purchasing it. But if you want to give something a go, if you like the fruity smells, I would say, you know, hop on it. It's um it's on the semi annual sale. So you can stock up if you're into that sort of thing. Um, is that it? Let me just take a quick look. And see what I have. Actually, you know what? Yes. So this is going to be it because that was all I could find that I've actually tried that's in the semi-annual sale. So this is just a really quick video. Um, the, the body lotion I called Starry Nights is actually 
Twinkling, Twinkling Nights, I think. Twinkling is in the name. Um, that body lotion, um, I looked it up as I was talking to you just now. It's actually not part of the semi-annual sale, so I won't cover it. But I do enjoy it. Um, I think I might like the Calypso better, the pink Calypso. But I just started using it, um, and it's fresh, and it washes clean away. And again, it's kind of similar. Um, it's an adult kind of fragrance, um, meaning it's not fruity or anything. Um, but as you can tell, it hasn't left, left a lasting impression on me. So I don't know whether I need to use it a little bit more, whether I'm just still like thinking about the pink Calypso, um, or if it's just not that memorable, but I will probably update you again when more of the products that I've tried, um, are on available on the site on sale. And after I've tried more of the products, cause I have several still that I've not done anything with, um, just wanted to give you a heads up that the semi-annual sale is going on and to come back full circle and review what I've tried so far. So on that note, I'm going to end this video. You guys take care. Be well. I will see you again in the next video and stay clean, stay safe, stay organized. Talk to you soon. Bye now.